First Alert Weather with Brian Allworth is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. Our cool weather continues. It's going to be another chilly day. Not a terribly cold day, but a lot of clouds, a lot of cool temps, and more rainfall. We had a little rain yesterday. Should be more widespread today. Already a little rain out there coming in from the south and west. First alert Doppler, this is right now, shows scattered rain from, say, Ripley County, Carter County East into Butler County, continuing to move east. Looks like Dexter is coming down 60. This is, you know, just little uh, small showers, light rain, nothing terribly heavy. Uh, you can see down toward the boot heel, Kennet about to get a little bit wet. Cooter, 55 getting wet. So most of the area is still dry at this hour, but as you'll see coming up, the rain should gradually expand to cover most of the area by early this afternoon. Current temps are in the 40s. Not terribly cold, but it won't warm up much today, right? With the clouds and scattered rain developing, 46 degrees, a light easterly breezes, uh, easterly breeze. At least it'll be a little less windy for a change today. It's been so windy for the last few months. I know we've been talking about this with the storm track right over us, but you can see here a little rain already, and there's even more lined up to our south and west where the weather's coming from. So yeah, rain jackets, umbrellas, not that we're expecting all day heavy rain, just scattered, mostly light rain. And to our north, some wet snow developing out of Nebraska into Iowa and uh, the Dakotas. So there is a winter uh, component to this system as well. But again, by about midday today, the rain's more extensive, gradually gets into southern Illinois, especially this afternoon, this evening. Now, if you're heading out this evening at 7 o'clock, we're still showing some scattered rain. But by about midnight, it's all gone, and tomorrow morning should be dry. But you will notice tomorrow, even though it's going to be dry, those wind arrows back. So after one day of less wind today, more wind tomorrow. Tomorrow evening, Friday evening, should be mostly, or we'll, we'll call it partly cloudy and dry, but it will be chilly tomorrow evening. So today's highs, upper 40s to mid 50s, and uh, yeah, scattered light rain developing. Doesn't look too heavy. Tonight, the rain pushes off. By tomorrow morning, it'll be dry, but breezy and chilly. Lows tomorrow morning, 30s to low 40s, a little cooler than this morning. And tomorrow, we get a break from the rain, but it'll still be cool for this time of year. Uh, Saturday and Sunday, if anything, even cooler and a better chance of more extensive rain especially in our western counties Saturday afternoon, moving out of our eastern counties by Sunday morning. So get ready for another round of rain over the weekend. It won't rain all weekend, but especially Saturday night looking wet, maybe a little thunder too. And then next week, dry, at least to start with, but staying cool. In fact, one thing we'll have to watch if we're gardeners, right, or have an orchard, we may get below freezing by about Tuesday morning with clear skies, maybe some frost on Wednesday morning as well, about 60 by Thursday afternoon.